good afternoon from our new home. Make sure you take your shoes off before entering. <laughs> yes, we are now in the process of moving into our new home. Uh, there's like no furniture over here. Whatsoever. No, we're working on it. We've just been packing boxes. And uh, we've had to paint, so like. Lots of painting, priming, all that stuff. Which is why we didn't have a video out on Monday. Mm. But here we are in our new home. It's still kind of moving a little bit. So just keep that in mind that this is not the finished product anyway. Anyway. But we'll give you a quick house tour and show you exactly what's going on in our new Tours Trek residence. Yes. So if you're ready to take a quick peek around the house on a somewhat of a home tour. Kind of. Let's go. <laughs> so this is the kitchen and ignore the mess we have on the counter. It's kind of a construction zone because we're replacing yeah. a lot of the uh, faucets and it's really heavy. Yep, like that one right there. We're changing a lot of the uh, the hardware in some of the rooms, kind of freshing it up. Paint stuff. Paint stuff. Light stuff. Light stuff. Oh, yep. Lounge fly bags. And... <laughs> yep. So we're we're kind of sprucing up the place, but I'll give you a quick little tour. This Look room. Look at this. Whoa. Look at this. What's that? I know we didn't have this in our apartment, so this is exciting. Ooh. Yes. Ooh. Modern day luxuries. <laughs> but over here we've over here we've got our living room. This is what our living room is going to be. Uh, beautiful plantation shutters, which are awesome. Um, but we're going to have our couch. Our couch is getting delivered by Costco tomorrow. Tomorrow. They're going to come set it up. It's going to be a nice big sectional, we right? Move all the stuff out of the way then. Yeah, pretty much. Yep. So we're going to have a nice big couch in the corner there. They're also going to be delivering a giant entertainment unit. Eventually. Right over here Not at some right. point. Yeah, I think it's like four weeks out, but yeah. a lot of the furniture on Costco is a bit delayed, but yeah. it's coming. And that's going to be the living room. And the other side of the island is this gorgeous kitchen with like absolutely upgraded appliances. The Keurig thing. Yeah, it has so, an ice brew coffee Keurig. Yeah, you just put it in there. It's kind of dirty, but... It's all good. Uh, we haven't tried it yet. Apparently you can get iced coffee from Keurig. We have K-Cups at home. Yeah, good. So. I, I have a Keurig at home. Yeah. So, interesting. And then yeah. the freezer is at the bottom. Yep. We're going to have to get used to that. Modern day household. And then we've got some drinks in here right now just to like get us through. Yep. Ignore the baby stuff. We, we need to find a way to get all that stuff oh, yeah. off. The previous owners had a child. And I guess they open stuff, so they tried to like block things with these baby things, which reminds me that I need to come up with a solution to fix this. I'm probably just gonna replace this entire door, to be honest with you. Yeah, so I'll probably replace the entire drawer as opposed to trying to pry these off. I have a putty knife, so maybe I'll be able to kind of like yeah. get rid of it that way, but. Pretty cool appliances. We got really upgraded appliances. They're General Electric. I can't open it because it's, I'm washing it empty, so anything will go away. Yeah. But then we've got a microwave. Fancy. A bunch of buttons. And then this has so many buttons. I was looking at it the other day and I was like, oh my God. What? <laughs> yeah, it's a dual range oven. Yeah, and it's, I've only opened the top so far. Yeah, there's a top and then there's a bottom. Oh no, I did open the bottom, that's right. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah. And then I did buy some lights from Lowe's to replace these. They're nice. I don't have a problem with these lights. They're a little modern looking. So we ended up buying some of these, uh, I guess, accent lights. But I think they would go really well up there if you can envision it. I think that would look really good. But uh, that'll be another project for another day. I'm trying not to bite off more than I can chew. Yeah, because you need a ladder to do that. Anyway. Yeah. You only have a step suite. That's true. And this is the bathroom. Yes, that's the bathroom, which I'm currently working on right now, replacing the hardware, the faucet. They had kind of that um, brush, or it wasn't even brush nickel, it was just a nickel plated one. But I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna replace it, kind of match the cabinets, because the cabinets are black. So I was thinking about maybe replacing the faucet with a matte black faucet and I think what I'll end up doing is replacing the mirror as well okay. with a black framed mirror yeah and then replace the light which I ordered new lights they got paint on it. yeah the, it yeah there's some paint on it <sighs> but I think we're gonna replace the lights with a black 
vanity light to kind of go with the faucet and everything. And then probably repaint the bathroom. Blue's nice. I like looking into the sky. But yeah, I think we're going to replace this with this like a... Else. Yeah, it, I think we're going to replace it with like a kind of a cream or stone colored wall. Something like that. Yeah. So, well, well that's, that's a project for another day. Yeah. I love the shutters yeah. throughout. And, and what's really cool is you can actually like open them up, which is neat. Down. Oh, that way. So, you could, I think they're called Bermuda shutters if I'm not mistaken. I don't know. But, beautiful. And since we were at it on a nice little shopping spree at Costco, we not ended up sponsored. Not, not sponsored by Costco. Or Casper. <laughs> but or we ended up buying uh, a Casper mattress, which if any of you have heard about it, it's apparently one of the best boxed, uh, guess, gel mattresses? What, what kind How of, can a, a mattress be technologically advanced? Uh, apparently this Casper is. And it's, it's a foam <laughs> mattress. I said gel mattress. It's a foam mattress. I should probably specify that. But we got a king, so we're going to get the king mattress for the first time we're gonna be sleeping like kings queens okay <laughs> all right well king and queen <laughs> and we ended up getting our furniture for the bedroom it's pretty neat it's like a fabric bed frame this is gonna be fun yeah but this is not getting built yet that's why it's still in the dining room in the box here maybe today who knows How far if we get done with there? painting we might be able to yeah but we're not gonna bring any of the furniture up until we're done with painting in the master bedroom which we'll go take a look at right now. So here we are in the master bedroom, which we are currently painting. It's kind of a war zone in here, but you'll see that we've kind of already started painting the walls. So it was a dark red color, which you see right here. We haven't gotten to this wall yet, but we decided to go with kind of a, beachier what is that? Lighter. Beachier light, yeah, it's like a beachy color. Yeah. You kind of got, let me see. It's like a light green, green gray. And then you got stone colored walls. Yeah. So yeah, it's definitely more airy. Yeah. And very bright. So yeah, we're, that, that'll be our project today. So we got to do another coat of paint here. And I think we need to do another coat of paint over here. And then I think we'll be good. Yeah, I think we have to get those little red down there. I forgot my paint brushes. Oh like yes. Like the small ones. There's some little remnants of the red wall on the baseboard, so we'll have to tidy that up. Yeah. But then I think the bedroom will be ready to get the mattress and the bed frame installed, and we can start sleeping over here. Yeah, we can bring Thomas over. Yeah, Thomas hasn't seen the place yet. Oh my God. He hasn't seen the place yet, but I'm sure he's gonna be super stoked and excited. I'm excited for him to see it. <laughs> he's gonna, he does this army crawl. He goes... Yeah, he kinda army crawls in when he doesn't know where he's going, yeah. so, or a place that he doesn't really know. So he'll probably do the army crawl into the, the new house. Yeah. Oh, and then we've got some fun themed bedrooms oh, yeah. <laughs> that will also be a project for another day. Another day. We've done a lot of painting. I'm over it. Yes. <laughs> Let's go check it out. So this room is this the, room can stay. <laughs> the dinosaur room. This they got little dinosaurs stay. on them. They're little decals. They're cute. But we're not keeping the dinosaurs. I'm I sorry. I want to change the color of the wall, but I want to keep the dinosaurs. <laughs> we're not keeping the. Can you the restick them? We're not keeping the dinosaurs. Can you restick them? We're not. We're not keeping the dinosaurs, Jen. I know you love dinosaurs, but you we're can not. Totally restick them. <laughs> anyway, this is gonna be the YouTube studio slash craft room. Mm -hmm. Super excited about that. Yeah. So I don't know how the setup will be. Uh, maybe. The computer will be back here. I'm not sure. We need a place to sit for the live streams or the universal yums. That's true. Yep. All that will be up here. So this will be the YouTube studio room where all the dinosaurs, <laughs> dinosaurs, <laughs> all the, I like we how they're at least do like, one. I never noticed this, but they're like eating the little, <laughs> the, well, they're chewing on the bones or something? What no, was... they're just, he, I think he's supposed to have an eggshell on the top. Oh, so he's hatching. Yeah, he's, he's hatching. hatching. He's hatching. Anyway, this will be the YouTube studio room. I feel like we gotta at least keep one dinosaur. <laughs> we'll, we'll think about it. <gasps> Triceratops. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, this will be the YouTube studio where we're gonna do a lot of the Universal Yums videos. Um, I feel like this is where a majority of the editing will be, and I know that you will also be doing crafts and stuff up in this room as well. Yeah, probably. While so. you're 
doing stuff. But yeah, it's a decent size. Good yeah. size for us to do all our YouTube needs. Corner to corner. Yep. And then this room is quite the experience. You've got Star Wars. I don't think that it, that's not painted on there. I don't. No, it's think. a sticker. Yeah, it's a sticker. Yeah. So they can yeah, come it off. Comes off. But this is another room we're gonna have to paint over at some point. This wall is a, chalk is a chalkboard wall. wall, which is I'm sure super fun as a kid. But it uh, doesn't quite suit the bedroom, the spare bedroom we're gonna do here. So I think what I'm gonna do over time, instead of dealing with the chalkboard wall, which is gonna be quite a, quite a chore, because I think you have to sand it down before you prime it. Yeah. I think what we might do is we might do shiplap yeah. up the wall. And I was kind of seeing some examples on at Lowe's and Home Depot and stuff, and they've got some really cool shiplap that's already like built to like stack on top of each other and you just kind of have to nail it into the wall. So I think that would be really cool with like a TV mounted on the wall with shiplap in the background. I think that would be really neat as a feature wall. So I think today's chores, since this is a home vlog, and right now you don't want to be really be at the theme parks. They're madhouse oh, yeah. right now. We can't get reservations at <laughs> all. Spring break, it's it's absolutely madness. So I guess it happened if to work think out. Think about it. If all the reservations are full, Disney Springs is going to be a mess too. Yeah, that's And it was true. a mess on St. Patrick's yep. Day too. So I think today will be a perfect home vlog day just to kind of get some stuff up around, you know, upkeep around the new house, prepping for our big move. And then once we get everything moved in, hopefully the crowds will die down from spring break and we can head back to the theme parks. I so. hope so. But yeah, today is a, a home improvement day where we're going to do some painting. So I have the GoPro downstairs. Yeah. I think I'll set it up in the room on a wide angle and just do a time lapse of us doing the second coat on this wall and the second coat on that wall over there. And then maybe start priming that Yeah, one. we can probably prime the final wall here. And then well, we... if you think about it, three walls, we could probably start putting the bed together. And then, we could. We might be able to do that tonight. Do that. Yeah. We might be able so to do that tonight. Thomas over? You really want to bring Thomas I do. over, don't you? I think it'd be great for the vlog. <laughs> All right, don't well, you want to see Thomas come over? We'll, we'll see. Give me a thumbs up if you want to. All right, it's well, going to happen whether you like it or not. Well, let's get all this done first and then we'll talk about bringing Thomas Work up. hard! <laughs> all right, let's get started. Okay, so the second coat has been applied to that wall there Jen is applying being nitpicky, and being nitpicky yeah. you're just kind of touching up the yeah, few there's spots. Some spots that just look streaky or something yeah so you're, you're touching those up on the and then I did the bottom of that wall. yes she came up and did the baseboards here and I'm noticing there are some spots on this wall up at the top here, where we are missing uh, a few spots. I gotta touch that up on the ceiling there. So yeah, I think we might just do some touch-ups on this wall, because for the most part this wall looks pretty good. Um, there's just some areas that need some work. But the problem is, we have run out of paint. Are we out? out? Well, just about. Okay. Not enough to do the next wall, which is right here, so we have some uh, we have some work ahead of us because we got to go to Lowe's to go get some more paint. Sorry, I'm looking to make sure it's not <laughs> nitpicking. <streaky. laughs> well, it just looks streaky, like in some little spots, it just looks a little like less paint made it or something. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. Well, we're gonna make a quick uh, Lowe's trip soon and get some more paint, so we have enough to take care of the back walls here. All right, busy day. Okay, so we're back at the house after a quick trip to Lowe's. Um, I've spent a shameful amount of money at Lowe's lately huh. on just everything for your new house. What did we get? We got, oh, let me show you some of the things we got for the master bathroom. We got uh, some neat vanity lights. So we got these really cool vanity lights that kind of have like, like a, I don't know, we're thinking we might do like a beachy theme in here since we kind of have that going on in this room. We might do it in here too, kind of carry it in. 
lighter colors on the wall. I think these are going to come down and uh, going to replace them with something that looks like this. And you'll see on the box, it's kind of like a sandalwood look, which is kind of neat, like a weathered oak. And I think uh, the glass, the clear glass will allow more light through than what you see up there right now, which is kind of a frosted glass. But you can see that it's starting to, it looks a little, I don't know if you can really tell, but it's a little rusted. So I'm going to replace those with some new vanity lights. Once again, project for another day. Just wanted to get it. Today's focus, finishing, painting that wall. Got our primer and our paint. It's going to be more of this color over here. And then uh, that's it for painting in this room. And then it's full steam ahead on uh, assembling the furniture. And Jen is working on the little touch-ups with her little, little tiny brush. It's not the best brush for it. No? Mm -mm. Really? But it's getting it done, so. Okay. Yeah. All right, yeah, so it's... progress. Yeah. But I think I'm gonna set up the GoPro now and I'm gonna start, uh, I'm gonna relay out the tarp here so that we don't get anything on our carpet and start priming the final wall of the bedroom. Now I'm gonna take a quick break from the primer because my package arrived. Yep, there it is. Air filters, hooray. I ended up getting a year supply of air filters for our air conditioning unit. Figure you change them out every three months, you get four of them, last you the entire year. Okay, so we did most of the first coat, I still have to get up in those nooks and crannies up above the doors and behind that door, but majority of it's taken care of. So I gotta get my little step stool here and uh, get in some of those tight corners to finish up the first coat. And then we can apply a second coat because you can still see the red poking through there. And then we can put on the actual paint and then maybe put the bed together tonight That'd be cool. maybe so now we're done with our final coat of primer on the final wall of the master bedroom all we have to do now is paint uh, the stone eagle which is the name of this particular paint color you'll see it's the same color as this wall so this color will go all the way around and touch up with that side. Uh, it is late in the evening because I didn't think that would take as much time getting all in the nooks and crannies, but it, uh, it took a while. But now it's time to paint. But first, we have dinner. I was gonna wait for dinner until we got the paint up, but I think we're gonna go ahead and eat dinner. We did Uber Eats, we're getting Burger Fi, one of my favorite burger uh, joints here in Orlando. Um, we're gonna go ahead and get some dinner when that gets delivered and then maybe come up and do the final uh, coat of paint, the actual paint. So I'm excited. I'm excited to see how the finished product will look. Dinner is served. Burger fi. Um. And I know Brandon's been in the video a lot, but I've definitely worked. <laughs> It's all over your legs. Yeah, it's fine. It's all right. We're about to we're about to put the paint on, but we need to eat our dinner first, and then we'll apply the final coat of paint, and then I the bedroom will be done. A burger five cheeseburger, green style. Yes, you got green style, which means there's lettuce as the, the bun. The lettuce bun, and they changed it to foil, which actually might be easier to eat. Uh, Was it paper before? Uh huh. Yeah. How is it? That was mostly lettuce. And I too got a burger from Burger Fi in signature Burger Fi style with the stamp on it. The stamp of approval. All right, so we're about to put our final coat on, Jen. I'm so ready. This is it. This so is over it. it. <laughs> we're done painting the master bedroom. Oh my God, it's taken forever. It's all right. But it'll, it'll look good when it's done. All right. Yes. So we're done stirring it. Now it's time to get to town on painting and uh, then be done be done and then we can start assembling the furniture in here because now look how it's opened up I know we got rid of all the silly 
plastic ones, the drop cloths, that was terrible. Um, the cloth ones are way better. They're more expensive, but they are better. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's get to painting. All right. Well, that went on pretty smooth. Jen had to stop the GoPro time lapse because she needed the step stool to hit those tiny, tiny parts at the top there. But yeah, it's, it's coming along. And it's drying super quick too. Real quick drying. So yeah, we might, around, might have enough time to get around to building furniture tonight, Jen. That'd be kind of cool. Yeah. That is it. We are done, Jen. Minus like a few touch-ups here and there. Yeah, I'm gonna do that tomorrow. The room is right. done. With a nice little feature accent wall there. It's nice. Turned out really good. And I think what we're gonna do, because it is getting a little late, I yeah. think instead of building the furniture tonight, we're just gonna bring it up here so that it's here. Yeah. And then uh, you work tomorrow, but I will build the furniture and we'll have our master bedroom. Yes. How exciting. Yay, I'm sweating. Look. <laughs> Paint and sweat. Yeah. <laughs> but at least once we bring the, uh, the bed frame up, we can go home and see Thomas. I miss him. <laughs> all right, we brought all the pieces of the bed frame up to the master. And I'd say the color scheme goes pretty good. Very earthy, earthy colors. I like it. So now that the pieces are all up here, we can head home, Jen, and say hello to Thomas. I'm tired. I'm beat. <laughs> You're tired? I'm beat, yeah. <laughs> Let's go. All right. Hi, Thomas. Hey, buddy. Are you ready to go to your new house? Tomorrow. We get to go over there tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. I think he's ready. I think he's ready for food. He, he might be ready for dinner too. So that's gonna do it for us here at our other home. Uh, temporarily. Yeah. Until we move to the new one. Hope you guys enjoyed this kind of unusual kind of home improvement home vlog. Let us know if you guys like vlog. this type of video. Um, uh, Got a lot of projects at the new house that I've got in store. Maybe we'll no vlog them. To do. Maybe. But only if you guys are interested. Otherwise, we'll still keep doing theme parks. Um, it's a little crazy at the theme parks right now, so we're going to let that die down, and then we'll go to the theme yeah. parks. But uh, if you like the video, be sure to give this one a big thumbs up. And Jen, if they want to join us on our adventures, tell them what to do. Make sure to tap that subscribe button and tap that notification bell to become a super subscriber. And until next time, See you real soon.